Buenos dias, everyone. This is Fixer back with Grim Fandango, the remaster version. Left off, wondering why we have such a giant litter box and uh, can't really accomplish much here. But I've uh, been farting around uh, Rubicava, looking at the blue casket and various places, and uh, have been a little stuck on where to go. So, these are the cat races here. I know I've got to place a bet or something, but uh, not quite there yet. I'm pretty sure there's another place or two I need to go. <laughs> Come on, go up, up, up. And to the side. I know I'm missing at least one or two places that I need to visit. Oh, it's taking forever. I think this lets me drop down. Oh, here we go. I think one is over here. I could be a statue of a famous Olympic gymnast, I guess. It's got the rings. Yeah, see, I've gone up in there. But if I remember correctly, I couldn't go... In these doors? Yep. Late night at the morgue, isn't it, Membrio? You know I can't sleep with John Doe's on the slab, Manny. If I don't ID these rose gardens tonight, I won't be ready for the two that come in tomorrow. And before you know it, I'm up to my ass in his areas. Swearing. Ooh. All right, so what do you got to take? What a sad story. These two sprouted and no one came down to claim them? Oh, you move so slow. Death makes sad stories of us all. How's business? How's business? Booming, unfortunately. More crime every day. And more and more sproutings like these. Something's happening back in Elmaro, I think. And its dark hand is finally reaching us here in Rubakava. What exactly are you looking for? I'm digging for a treasure <laughs> that part of me does not wish to find. For when I uncover that sad doubloon that tells me who this poor soul is, my reward is not riches, but the chance to make a phone call and break somebody's heart. <laughs> of course... With this equipment, the search could go on for some time. Well, yeah, that's like a like a fork. Can I help? Sure. Grab hold of this leaf right here. I don't trust. Manny? I can't do it. I know. <laughs> I was just testing. How do you do this job? Without becoming jaded, you mean? My secret to happiness, Manuel, is that I have the heart of a 12-year-old <laughs> boy. I keep it over here in a jar. Would you like to see it? <laughs> no. Typical LucasArts Sorry. joke, being uh, literal. Joke. Do you ever worry that your job is getting to you, member you? Well... Forensic botany is a trying job, Manny. But have you ever spent much time here with a florist? In life, they became florists because they love flowers. But here, a flower is a symbol of pain, of death within death. Their conflicted feelings build and build. And eventually, they become quite mad. Thanks for the tip. I guess I'll send balloon bouquets from now on. Hey, I've got some, uh, well, I had some clown balloons. Hey, why do you stay in town? Why don't you head off toward the Ninth Underworld? Manny, you can only search for something for so many years before you stop believing in it altogether. He doesn't believe in the Ninth Underworld. You don't believe in the Ninth Underworld? Why do you think we're all here in Rubakava? Because you're waiting to earn off your time or you can't afford passage or... Manny... We've given up, all of us. When you've been here long enough, you will too. Well, don't let me bother you. Always nice to have visitors. Hmm, that's not good. 
Does the ninth uh, level not Please? exist? I know it's a poor coroner who blames his tools, Manny. But how am I supposed to turn up anything with the equipment they give me? Hey, I had a government job for years, man. I know how you feel. What can I do besides go up there? Nothing? What's this? Can you move a little faster, Manny? It's empty. Only until I finish up here. Hey, should I close this? No. I'm trying to air it out. So nothing. Alrighty. And there was pretty much nothing in there. Oh, that's right. I wanted to see about going up this way. Aha! And again, nothing. Except up here. Oh, this is my place! Hmm. Alright, well, let's check to see if uh, anything's going on. Anything new happening? I have a feeling nothing. Looks like Lupe's been in the sugar again. Evening, Lupe. That's... Hi, Manny. What is she doing down there? I have a note there? for you from Lola. Lola? Yes. Now, where is it? Where, 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 where? Oh, here. No, wait. Dang. I have a whole new system for messages. Just let me... Here. No, no, wait. Ah, be quiet. Here it is. Yep. Wait a second. I guess she's been if in I'm... the sugar. There was something inside. It felt like a key. A key? Yes. But did somebody come back here and snake the key while I was sorting the coats? Who would do that? They messed up my whole system! Oh, come on, Lupe! Looks like Lupe's been in the sugar again. Looks like Lupe's been in the sugar You're again. You're killing me! Alright, let's go up here. Come on. Alright. This was a little table for gambling I've always meant to hide that better for cheating I should say le numero gagnant le 5 rouge and very monk 5 red operates who no ladies and gentlemen please play madame et monsieur rien ne va plus les jeux sont faits ladies and gentlemen the magnet is closed no more bets please I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. I guess I can control where the ball lands. Le Le cinq, rouge, and it keeps landing red five. Red. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux s'il vous plaît. Ladies and gentlemen, please place your bets. Mesdames et messieurs, rien à Place your bets. Les jeux sont faits. Ladies and gentlemen, betting is closed. No more bets, please. Okay. And... I can't choose any of these. <laughs> Look up below. Le numéro gagnant. Le neuf. Rouge and Perimon. Well, I did something Nine. bad. Red. This is an outrage. Uh -oh. I bet on number two. Why didn't it come up number two? <laughs> I see. Je suis vraiment désolé. I do not pick the winners. These things are all controlled by the man upstairs. And don't tell him that. Please tell the man upstairs that Police Chief Bogan was oh, very no. upset when he left. And when he returns later this evening, he would prefer to have better luck. Oui, monsieur. Bonsoir. I will definitely tell him. I don't really. I don't think I want that guy in my place. He's expecting to win every time. Come on. I guess I can't go that way. All right. Um. Let's go back downstairs, but not this way, is it? Or is it? Whoa. Yes, it's this way. Sup, Gladys? Haven't talked to you in a while. You have anything new to say? 
Manny, the police chief walked through and I tried playing a song for him and he yelled at me. Oh, don't sweat it, Mano. He's just mad because he lost at the tables. Isn't he always supposed to win so he keeps liking us and never raids us? He wouldn't raid us. It's a holiday. I just had a run-in with Domino and Meche. We're leaving town. What? What? How? Domino's got Meche. We're going after them tonight. What should I do? Just sit here until I get a boat. Sit here. Check. Okay. Sounds good. I know it. You just sit there, boy. All right, let's go in the back room. Go. Yep, the the chief was right here. He's he's not happy. What do you guys have to say about that? Everything okay down here? What happened to Monsieur Bogan's lucky streak? It ran out. What? So did he. <laughs> That's it? That's all you have to say? Le numéro gagnant, le 18, Rouge, Berrema. Not while they're losing. 18. Whatever. Okay. Let's get out of here. Probably get arrested on my way out. And I can't go down, so back up. And this way, yep. We'll head outside. Down here. Nowhere else to go but down. Or what's this way? Can I look through that? One way to find out. Gross. How long was that raven sitting there? I guess I should have done this a long time ago, eh? Lola, Lola, where are you? All right, well, that did nothing. So we didn't miss out on anything. Okay, let's get out of here. We'll head over this way. I'm always feeling like I'm missing clicking on something. Let's go down. I know there's still at least one or two more places that I, I just missed. We'll find out. See, there's the blue casket. I've been down there many times. Down here. Go. No! Yeah. There we go. Now, I remember seeing a lighthouse in the background. And I am pretty sure I can get to the lighthouse. I just don't know how. And I know it's... Is it this way? Oh, no, this is the way to uh, the tattoo artist. But I think if you come from this way, you see a lighthouse. And it's like over here. Oh! I'm not sure what the hell I did there. There's the lighthouse. What are these guys? Oh, they're bees. I'm not a fan of bees. Let's talk to him, I guess. Mm, these bees don't seem too busy. Cold one, huh, Terry? Yeah, it's always cold when you're unemployed, Manny. Aha! Unemployed bees. Who's unemployed? Aren't you guys in the union? The union? <laughs> they don't look after us, little guys. They're run by the coppers. And you of all people should know, Manny, that the cops are in bed with the gamblers. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Hey, I run an honest joint. We ain't in bed with nobody. What about the protection money? We pay every week. On the nose, through the nose, like an honest place. <laughs> you know I mean? This town is just a big conga line of hustlers. All laughing and dancing and scratching each other's backs. Uh-huh. Why aren't you guys up there working? You don't know the deal down here on the docks, do you, Manny? If you want to get the jobs, you have to pay the unions extra dues. And that ain't cheap. We don't pay, and so they put us on barrel duty. So what is barrel duty? Why don't you just pay the union off then? We got our pride, Manny. We're straight stingers, you know? Not to mention we just don't have any cash to spare now that we're not working. I mean, it's like a problem. We're, uh, uh the solution it makes the problem, uh, worse. Like a catch-22? <laughs> yeah, wow. I wish I knew ways like that. If the union is crooked... Why don't you register a complaint? <laughs> That's a good one, Manny. Did you hear that, guys? He thinks we 
should register a complaint. God, why, why don't you let these guys speak, man? You bees are being exploited. You should do something about it. Yeah, what can we do? We're just a handful of unorganized drones. We don't know nothing about nothing except just how to take it on a chin. <laughs> why are the bees so big anyway? Why are the cats so big? I think you're just a bunch of complainers. You don't know what it's like, man. Every day we come down here, we try and make an honest living. We find out that you gotta be a crooked bee to win down here. He knocks the pollen out of you, man. He makes you weak. Since you're not using Ooh, tools. tools, think I could borrow them? Well, we sold them to feed our families. Then how are you ever gonna work? I, I told you things were messed up down here, Manny. I, I told you. How? If the cops own the union and gambling's in bed with the cops. Yeah, yeah, and then who really runs the gambling? I do. Well, no offense, but uh, Max Amino is really the big boy in town, obviously. But word is, he gets his orders from some hardcore gangsters in El Mero. Yeah, that fancy cat track is really just a big laundromat. If you get I get your drift. Hey, can I borrow one of your union cards? What are you kidding? You know how much I had to pay Chow Chilla Charlie to get mine? Just let me borrow it. You guys know a seaman naranja? Nah, CBs and sailors don't mix. But you're in the same union. Well, maybe so, but some traditions are sacred there, Manny. You bees gotta be strong. Things just aren't the way they should be down here, Manny. It's like the worker bees, they do all the work. But we can't affect the, uh, the, uh... Ah, it's like the way that things are produced should be controlled by... <laughs> I mean, we should... Ah, forget it. I'm just a dumb, hungry, out-of-work bee. Aww. All right, these straight stingers. Can I talk to them more? It's the buzz, boys. Yeah, it's bad down here, Manny. It's like... It's like, like you bees... Yeah, I don't need to go through that again. Can I talk to these? Mm, these bees don't seem too Same busy. thing. All right, can I go this way? I can. Yeah, there we go, the lighthouse. That's what I want. There we go. Go up, or don't go up. It won't let me view it. Why don't I get options? It's locked. It's locked. Well, I guess I don't get options because it's locked. That's it. I can't do anything else. Can't go up there either. Okay then. Let's double check what I got in my inventory. What the hell is this? It says revolutionary design leaves can I just say Oh the can opener. Kitty. What the hell can I use this on? Can I use it on the door? It's locked. <laughs> Maybe not. All right, what else do I have? Got my scythe. I got that. Got that. And this was me and this ticket printer. Ticket printer. Gonna make a mint. What can I do with this thing? Okay. I can change the dates or the day. What is this? The dates? The month? That must be the days. It goes up higher than twelve. This must be the month. Or not. Okay. What did I do? I want to look at that. What did I print? Race. Oh, race week and day. It's a betting stub for, let's see, Tuesday. Week 18, race 12. <laughs> week 18, race 12. Okay. Okay. So I guess I gotta make that up for the racetrack. So maybe I should head over to the racetrack and see what I can do. Excuse me, Mr. Worker Bees. Straight singers. Whoa. Alright. Can't go up there. Okay, I can go to the right. Oh. Then what's down here? Oh, I see. Alright. And the cat races, I think, were over here. Chop, chop. No. Over here. 
Oh, my sense of direction is just not as good as it used to be. Okay, I know they're this way now. And we go up. And up again. And up one more time. Oh, let's talk to that guy. Doesn't he say a particular day? He says coming up on Thursday or something. Anybody there? I told Tuesday. We don't give up the kitty hats till Tuesday. Oh, another Chowchilla Charlie original. Give me one good reason not to throw you out of here. Because I'll tell Max to fire you. <laughs> okay. So, if today is not Tuesday and he's talking about it's coming up on Tuesday, then I am assuming today is Monday. Alright, so we got Monday. And this is the race and this is the week, I think. Or not. So this goes up to 32 and this goes up to 15. Can I change that? No. Alright. I don't know what to do there, so we'll leave that go. Let's go up to the races. Uh, no, it's not this way. Is it this way? Come on, Manny, hurry up. I don't... There we go. Don't forget what? What am I not forgetting? Hello? Oh, hi! Betting stub, please. Oh, I, I don't have a betting stub. Oh, okay. Bye. Tuesday is Kitty Hat Day. Come on, I need a race to happen. Give me a race. Is there a way to trigger one? And I don't remember what that guy needs, but I'm pretty sure I don't have it. Five minutes to post. Okay, so five minutes to post. So how about I just make one for Monday? Okay. So I don't know what race it is. How about we just do one and one? See what happens. Okay. Good enough for me. Maybe give it to this guy? Hello? Oh, hi! Betting stub, please. Here you go. For your own sake. Hey, this looks different than our usual. <laughs> well, that's because it's from uh, last season. All right, just a second. <laughs> there you are. Legit. Just a bunch of cats. Yeah, but look how fast they're running. Oh, oh, sorry, sir. Wait, what just happened? I'm sure you'll be a winner next time. What? What did he give me? Or what did he... Oh. Hmm. Please keep off the track. I'm guessing that I'm supposed to listen to what's going on here and then find out who the winner is and take it back to the ticket guy and give him the fake winning ticket. That's what I'm assuming. Alright, let's try this again. Monday 1-1. One, one. All right, let's do this. Okay, put that back. Let's go to the other guy then. Well, it's the same guy, but different window. Anybody there? I told you, we don't give out the We're kitty hats till Tuesday. Here. Byron's memory. Oh, another Chowchilla Charlie original. Thanks. Can't get enough of these. Smokey's ride. Okay. Oh, don't tell me I need to. I need to know what number they are. Oh boy. That's not good. I think I need to know what number they are in the list. Like Myron's is number one. 
That means I need to write this stuff down for next time. Oh, oh, he was number one. That one was easy. Oh, oh. All right, so I don't know what week it is, though. But maybe this one won. Oh, he didn't win. It's still going. Hurry up! Get it over with. Oh, there they go! Okay. Uh oh. <laughs> That's gross. How many laps are there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If Myron's memory, that's the only one I remember. It was the first one. We're going with Myron's memory. Come on. I don't remember which position I am not spot is in. I want to watch the actual race, man. I don't like that I only get to see this. Come on. Oh, damn it. Or is that the end? It's still going. Oh, it's so misleading. Closing in, I thought he was in the lead. What about Dribble for Gibble? No! Screw you, Spot! Well, we know Myron's was number... He was number one. Let's see what happens if I print a number one ticket. Alright, let's go with that. Let's see what happens. Go! Is this the wrong one? Hello? I got a pen and paper ready for next time. Betting stub, please. Here you go. All right, just a second. <laughs> there you are. I don't know what this is. What is he giving me? Cats again. Sorry, sir. I'm sure you'll be a winner next time. Mm. All right, well, that does it for this episode. Hopefully next episode I can get a, a winning ticket early on. We'll see. But uh, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, we'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.